Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Kalamazoo, Michigan with the Michigan Constitutional Crusader and Stevie Boy, a.k.a. for frickin' media as they, well, try to go into the local unemployment office, which is really only open to appointments only and end up being trespassed. So let's go ahead and sit back. Relax and enjoy the show. Open by appointment only. Sit out there walking for Oh, dude? Okay. No, no pictures. Hey, you touch me. No, 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 yourself, what? woman. No, no. Don't you no touch pictures. Me. Damn, Stevie. Uh, it sounds like a. Uh, you're trying to talk to her like she's a freaking dog or something like that. Don't you touch me. So let me ask you something, Stevie boy. Did you ever talk to your mama like that? Because I'm sure she would have, uh, well, laid the smacketh down on you if you tried that with her. Go back inside and go to work. Hey. No, no. Come on, Tina. Go. No pictures, man. Go. I don't care what she said. Uh, go. Go to an emergency. She ain't gonna put her hands on yeah, that. There's pictures in here. They're filming in here. Yes, we are. For what purpose and who are they? For what purpose and who are they? For what purpose and who are they? That's all right. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Mm -hmm. It's none of your business who I am. That's right. Okay, so. Go back inside and go to work. Go back inside and go to work. Like we're not even here. Oh, yeah. Right. Thank you. Oh, yeah. This is the man behind the camera, Michigan Constitutional Crusader. He and Stevie Boy tend to hang out quite a bit and uh, wreak havoc on the world at large because, well, they've got nothing else better to do than be a royal pain in the ass to everybody that exists. But let's carry on, shall we? Good job, guys. Go back inside and help all the people who need help. Mm -hmm. Cool, you'll get educated, Tina. Oh, are you predicting the future? Well, maybe you should have taken a deeper look into that crystal ball that you've been hiding in your back pocket because it would have shown you that uh, this is not going to work out too well for you. So uh, you might want to go back to that uh, dime store psychic and uh, return that crystal ball because it sure as hell didn't work out in this scenario. A little longer than a few minutes later. <laughs> you know, you gentlemen really intrigued me. Do it. You come here with, you know, the cameras, uh -huh. and you're afraid to show your face. I'm not <laughs> afraid. Okay. Not afraid to show Do that face. thing, man. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great day, gentlemen. You too, buddy. <laughs> wow. All I gotta do is not just ignore us, man. That's ridiculous. No, uh, what's ridiculous here is a couple grown-ass men acting like a pair of spoiled, petulant little children. I swear, I work with special needs children, and most of them have better manners and better behavior than these two supposed grown men. I mean, that's what's ridiculous as well. You want it? Sure. That was a fabulous story. Excuse me. Hey, don't block people's ingress. You, you, you need to step in. aside. Absolutely we you can. You can't come in here. No, you're not. Out. Please. Absolutely we can. Allie? It says walk-ins walk available. Public building. The issue is them. On, on a public I'm building? Really? Okay. It's public. 
It is. You're being the officer. It's public. Hey, I've been to several other of these it's Michigan workplaces and they let us in. Officers there. Okay. Hey, guys. Huh? You're yeah. being asked to leave? Okay. It's, it's public. public. It's public. Okay. They can public. still ask you to leave. They can ask, ask, but I don't have to unless I commit a crime. But we're no, just here documenting. Just, actually, our, actually, huh? Oh, that same old fraudulent line that you can't trespass me unless I commit a crime. Well, uh. Don't you know that that is utter bullshit right there? In every state of the union, you can be trespassed off of property if you refuse to leave when you are asked to do so. And Michigan is, of course, no different. You blooming idiots. Actually, trespassing is a crime when you're being asked to leave. Not a public levels. property. Not on public property. There's a difference between private property and public property. Okay. Private property, mm -hmm. you can only ask or trespass someone from public property if they're committing a crime, if they're being disorderly, if they're being, you know, harassing, menacing, any of those things. That well, would, is an actual crime. That, and then they want you to trespass, we can get you guys to move along. So You can't trespass someone from public property unless they commit a crime, sir. And just because they feel like I'm committing, committing a crime doesn't mean I'm Well, looky what we got here. Freaking media, the uh, freaking YouTube law scholar. How many times have you used that argument and how many times has it actually worked out in your favor? Probably not that many times. So why do you keep on using it? At least modify it to try to make yourself sound a little bit more intelligent than you actually are. Dude, I just wanted to come in and check it document out. Document people working, what our, our tax dollars go, the public employees working, you know, how they're helping the community here with all See the what job they postings offer. they have. Well, when I'm done, yeah. As soon as I get all the pictures I wanted to get. But they were I just want to go to that wall over there yeah, and check out the resources. Then I'm out. It's like me coming to your police department and you're asking me to leave. You yeah, can ask, can. but I don't have to. Uh, that's not accurate. That is accurate, sir. That's okay. totally accurate. So Yeah, yeah. That's totally accurate. Well, we need you guys to leave, okay? And if we don't leave and finish our business, then you're going to be detained. You're going to be detained, huh? For what? For trespassing. Yeah, I understand. You cannot trespass someone from public property unless they commit a crime. That's can I get your name works. and badge number, please? Yeah, David Kabaki, badge yeah, that's number 14773. That's how the law works, man. That's how the law works. So I'll just file a Complain on you then. I'll leave under threat of arrest. So, so you're threatening arrest of if we don't leave, right? Just trying to get you guys to move along. Would be great. Okay, and staff here is asking for you guys to leave. Forty-one is asking for you guys to leave. If I go to a city park and I'm standing in the middle of a park and I'm recording, not doing anything illegal, and you come up to me and say you need to leave this park, that's not off order. Well, you see, Stevie Boy, the problem with that is, is that is a traditional public forum. This place is not a traditional public forum. It is not a government agency, as the, uh, manager told you and as such uh, this manager has every right to ask you to leave and trespass you off the property because well you are violating their policies so therefore get the f out of there you smooth brain dumbass time place and manner just having a camera does not constitute a crime. So this is protected under the I First Amendment. I did not address that whatsoever. Okay, I know, but they're all worried about my camera. That's the only reason they have an issue is because I have a camera. But, but discriminating against me because I have a camera is like discriminating against someone who's black, brown, yellow, male. You no, know, it's not the illegal man. It's not. Oh, yeah, Stevie Boy, when all other arguments fail. Yeah, go for the civil rights one. That, uh, yeah, that one rarely ever works either, dude. I mean, that's the last gasp of a desperate moron right there going for the racial false equivalence fallacy. Oh, boy, that is just plain wrong right there. No, ma'am, it's not even a discussion. Don't need it. The Constitution gives us 
the consent. That's what I'm trying to say. Under the First Amendment, freedom of the press. If it were private property, we would need disclosures, but we don't need them on public. You understand what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. Because I've been into several Michigan Works offices, and they give us a tour of the place. And they're super cordial. So is it an issue with you leaving that number? Can I get pictures of the resources they have over? That's why I came here, for, for all of my viewers, so they can see. They're asking for you to leave. And, so, and, if I, and if I refuse to leave, are you going to arrest me? Is that what you're going to do? Yeah, you're going to arrest me. Yeah. Uh, detained or arrested? Oh, we'll work from there. Oh, I see. Okay. So that's pretty much a threat. If I, if I refuse pretty much. Okay, I got you. Cool. Right. Blake, for you, and, and what's her name? Allie and Tina Allie. need complaints, too. Thanks for you guys, too. Yeah, yeah. 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 You have a nice day, too. Awesome day. And I'm going to stay right here. How about that? There. Oh, off the property. That's funny. It's public property. That's funny. Off the property? Really? And of course, they decide that they're going to go retaliate against the police officers by filming their vehicles. Oh no, oh no, you're filming our police vehicles. Yeah, okay, whatever, dude. Uh, that's not really all that much in the way of retaliation. That ain't shit. But hey, whatever, flicks your bick. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?